We got your message. We appreciate your willingness to help. But are you sure you're up for the mission? When Bennett told me about the horrors he endured while in White Mantle captivity, I felt it my duty to assist. We'll blast these zealots back into the history books. All right. I don't know what'll happen inside, but I'm glad you're with us just the same. We'll let you know when we're ready to begin the assault. Invaders at the gate! Ready the defenses! Notify Zera and await her orders. Figures we couldn't just walk right in. We need to find a way to reach that lever. They're my own blend of black powder, magnetite shards, and a few other compounds. The resulting shrapnel blast shatters everything in range, including magical barriers. The downside? They're highly unstable. If they take a good shock or are dropped, they would kill everything nearby. So don't even ask. You can't have one. Expert is an overstatement, but yes, I'm familiar with the subject. They seem to manifest in areas of high magic concentration. The Maguma has been bathing in energy since Mordremoth's death. I suppose we should have expected that to happen. Hm. If we can draw on it, we may be able to use it to our advantage. Or cause some unpredictable results. Magic, especially in high concentrations, can be difficult to control. Bennett shared his story after being freed at Salvation Pass. I knew you'd want to strike while we were deep in enemy territory. So I'm at your disposal. I have plenty of supplies, including explosives that should get us inside their fortifications. After that, we'll have to improvise. It seems as if our enemy has been constructing this complex for quite some time. I don't know what's inside. We're ready. Has everyone made peace with their gods, spirits, deities, or... trees? Good. I'm carrying a heavy payload and won't be of much use in a fight. I can cast spells when absolutely needed, but for the most part, you'll need to keep me alive. You think you can do that? Any volunteers for escort duty? <coughs> Fine, we'll figure it out as we go. Lead the way. Glenna. En route! I'm not your puppy! Protect me. I'm about to try something. What are you doing? Getting us across. How did you do that? Practice. My hero. You really showed that lever who's boss. Are you familiar with the concept of friendly fire, Glenna? Bomb planted. Cover your ears. Clear. Fight me! I want these intruders destroyed! History is being made today, and nothing can get in the way! Who was that? Our next target. Pick up the pace, people. We've got a party to crash. There's a path through that cave. We may want to split into groups and take them by surprise. Make sure someone stays with me. I need protection. There. Prepare for target identified. Watch your step. Try to destroy the mine, but don't get too close. Keep them out at all costs. She seems particularly motivated to keep us out. Something big is happening inside. Someone get up there and take care of that cannon. Area
give life! Your soul for Lazarus! Come to me. Roger. This is it. Keep watch while I prepare the explosives. This should be the last barrier in our way. Everyone clear? Explosion imminent. That went flawlessly. If you say so, let's head inside. How dare you set foot on sacred ground! Whatever it is you're doing here, it's not going to work. Way to stick it to the White Mantle, you Lazarus will lead the White Mantle to rule a new Krita, and there's nothing you can do to stop his return. You're already dead. Enjoy my creation. It'll be the last you see. That's one powerful Mesmer right there. She just slipped up. They may have Lazarus. If so, then the sacrifices at Salvation Pass were meant to heal him. Good luck without me. You're nothing but a minor inconvenience. His return is imminent! Who will die next? I've had enough of you! What is real? Can you tell? My army is limitless! Keep your hands off that! You can't win! Sol D'Alessio, so you started this mess. Look at this place. It almost defies explanation. What are your thoughts on Zira? I know as much about her as you. She's powerful, no doubt, and she commands a rather large force. If I had to guess, I'd say she's a mesmer. How can you tell? I just have a feeling. I mean, look at this place. The statues, the paintings. I swear they're watching us. Don't trust everything you see. Deceptions abound. I guess Bennett was right about Lazarus. Technically, we don't know if Lazarus is actually here. I mean, maybe he is. Or maybe they're summoning him from another dimension? 
I have to admit my knowledge of the Mersat is limited. They've been out of sight and mind for more than 200 years. But I will concede that Bennett was likely onto something. These militants wouldn't be muttering that your death will bring him life without it meaning something. What's your theory on bloodstone weapons? Long ago, the White Mantle sacrificed humans on the Maguma bloodstone. They trapped the spirits of the sacrificed inside magical containers, which were then transported to where they needed large amounts of energy. Specifically to the door of Komali, where the magic kept their enemies, the Titans, at bay. And we all know how that worked out. But we never really knew what these devices were actually made from. If the sacrifices at Salvation Pass are any indication, the soul batteries of old were chunks of charged bloodstone. Now with all this loose magic, they're using the charged fragments as weapons and as power sources to heal their god. We recovered barrels of charged bloodstone fragments from Salvation Pass. I bet they were being transported here. And they've managed to use those shards in their weapons. That's my guess, at least. How's Bennett doing since the rescue mission? I'm not sure. I assume he regrouped with his squad and returned to Divinity's Reach to report on the situation. I'm glad he's safe now. He seems like a good man, despite his, uh, quirks. What do you mean, quirks? He's always betting his missing eye. Either he's a lousy gambler, or he took one on the head while held captive. Or he's making a fashion statement. Hmm. How did you learn to create ley lines? Ley lines are just channels of flowing magic. I simply draw the energy together in an effort to redirect it. So I don't actually create ley lines. They're already there, in a manner of speaking. And since magic is in great supply these days... You're able to manipulate it more easily in the Maguma jungle. Nice trick. Thanks. I'm sure the Priory will be excited to read my field notes. Proof that even the misguided have some redeeming qualities. Strange how a bunch of delusional fanatics can make such interesting art. We failed to control Kryta hundreds of years ago, but they're still trying. Why won't they give up? It seems I underestimated you. But I don't need to destroy you. I only need to slow you down. I'm clipping your wings. Try not to fall to your death. A new era for Kryta begins with the return of Lazarus. Prepare yourselves for his awakening. There's no way an ordinary Mesmer could wreak this kind of destruction. Is she siphoning magic from bloodstone shards? I really want her toys. You're living on borrowed time. just activated something.
break you! Time we settled this. My thought exactly. How does it feel to make it so far, only to fail? Your life is mine. The Tyria you know is about to change. And there's nothing you can do to stop it. Living in your cities, manipulating your politics. to claim what is ours! He is almost complete! Even if I die, he will live! on your grave.
crime everywhere. You can't hide. Submit to the white mantle. What happened? What I'm... Oh my. I see you've made a mess of the place. You shattered the bloodstone shards and caused a lay rift reaction. That would explain things. Congratulations on silencing a high-ranking white mantle zealot. Not many can say they've done that. When you're all done high-fiving and back-slapping each other, you may want to head down to the stasis chamber. What's in the stasis chamber? Go see for yourself. All I can say is that I think we have a problem on our hands. Where have you been? While you were dealing with Zira and her ill-tempered illusions, I investigated the courtyard. There's all manner of white mantle propaganda stashed in strange places. You may want to poke around there if you haven't already. Then I heard the ruckus you made by interfering with the lay rifts and bloodstone shards, so I hurried here. What's in the stasis chamber? All I can say is that I think we have a problem on our hands. Great. I wasn't expecting Zira to put up such a fight. She was no ordinary Mesmer, that's for certain. She harnessed more magic than Matthias back at Salvation Pass. All this tinkering with bloodstone fragments and loose energy is dangerous business. Magic is becoming more difficult to control. It's behaving in unpredictable ways. Remember Slothosaur? I wouldn't have imagined such a weird creation under normal circumstances. And don't even get me started on what Zira managed to accomplish here. How many Mesmers can rip apart the very foundation of a castle like this? It's frightening. All this mayhem is real, not some magician's trick. This castle is in shambles, and I doubt it's going to return to normal anytime soon. Do you think we'll see any other creatures changed by magic like Slothosaur? That weird creature back in Salvation Pass? Ugh, where do I begin? In all my travels, I have never seen anything quite so freakish. It's as if a sloth and a slug had too much wine and woke up the next day with regrets. Huh. Do you think that's actually possible? After he died, he released magic. Hard to say if the White Mantle experimented on him or the residual magic released by Mordremoth caused him to mutate. Either way, I hope not to encounter another. A shame he was killed, though. I bet whoever beat him to death probably feels absolutely terrible. He just wanted a hug. You're not serious, are you? Where do you come from? And why are you here? All these shards must have been taken from a larger source. But what happens when you fragment a bloodstone? These shards are depleted. They're devoid of magic. Were they using them to revive the last Mersat? We caused an unstable reaction when we destroyed the bloodstone shards. Did Lazarus escape? Or was he killed in the process? What happened here? <laughs> 